So I have a really cool technique to show you guys today. Um, it's really easy and you don't need much. You just need nail polish and straws. I'm using regular size straws and the coffee stir straws, these tiny ones, but you could just use the regular size. It's fine. And since today is the opening day of the 2012 Olympics, I thought I would use this technique in a Olympics inspired design, but it's really easy and I think it's fun and I really hope you guys like it. All right, I already painted a white base color on all of my nails and I have a piece of foil and that's what I'm going to put the nail polish on and the foil keeps the polish from drying too quickly. So I'm going to start off with my pinky and I have a red polish right here and I'm going to put some on the foil. And you want a decent amount. Okay. And then you're going to get your straw. I'm going to start off using the bigger straw. And you're just going to dip it in the polish. And as you can see, uh, the polish just goes around the end. And then you just dab it on your finger. So I'm doing this to kind of look like the Olympic rings and it's a bit harder with the bigger size straws than it is with the coffee straws especially on my tiny pinky and I'm just gonna put it all over my nail So that's with the bigger straw, and then I'm also going to use the smaller size. And same thing, you just want to make sure the polish is on the outside of it and not covering it up. And then you just dab it. So as you can see right there, there was polish covering the end, so it just made it a big dot instead of looking like a ring. And to fix that, what you can do is just get a little bit of white and just fill it in with a dotting tool. But there's one finger down. Okay. So, and then for the next, oops, for the next finger, I'm going to use green. And you're going to want to use a new side of the straw each time or else the colors are just going to blend in and just make a big mess. So just on the outside. And then you just... With the bigger size straw, you kind of have to roll it on because it won't lay flat on your finger. And I'm getting the small size straw to just kind of fill in some other places. So the thing with the smaller straw is that it's easier for the polish to cover up the end. So if you could see on this dot I just did, it didn't completely leave it open in the middle. So before you um, put it on your nail, you just want to double check that it's not um, covering up the hole. Okay, and then for the next one, I'm doing black. Okay, and then this one, I'm doing yellow. And for the thumb, I'm going to do blue. And 
Okay. So these are supposed to kind of look like the Olympic rings, except not as literal and a bit more abstract. But you could switch up the colors and do whatever you like. But I think it's pretty easy and it's a fun little technique. And I hope you guys like this tutorial.